The original London Dungeon was made between 1974 and 1976, depending on which source you use, but it was owned by Annabel Geddes by 1976, and her version of the dungeon was very different from the one we know today. It wasn't on County Hall, but it was in Tooley Street, a mysterious set of arches next to London Bridge Station, which made a great setting for a dungeon. It featured many waxworks depicting torture and scenes like Boudicca and Queen Mary, and it terrified people with no actors. However, over the years, actors arrived, and the place got even busier until 2013, when it was closed and reopened on South Bank, inside of County Hall. Due to this, many old props were sold, but not the 1970s waxworks, or the mysterious gargoyles that laid in the entrance. But more importantly, what happened to the waxworks? Well, it was discovered in late 2013 in a warehouse in Bermondsey that the props were still around. They were in good condition too, as if you were to look at pictures from the old dungeons and look at the pictures of the props as they're found, you could tell most of them apart which shows that they're still in good preservation but many of the other props still haven't been found and will they ever be found? Hopefully maybe the people who brought stuff at the market will eventually start selling their stuff I bet the stocks will make quite a lot of money either way I hope you enjoyed today's video see you in the next dungeons <laughs>